Hello there, Stampin' Friends. Welcome to Movie Monday with Jody Breckbill, Stampin' Queen. It has been quite a while since I have done a Movie Monday, and my apologies. Uh, it's been on my list of things to do, but things just got a little crazy in October. Um, I was hosting my first weekend, full weekend retreat. I went on vacation. I was trying to do my Christmas stamp stack so woo, it just went a little nuts. But I am back in the studio. I am catching up slowly but surely, and we are in November already. So I wanted to make sure that you guys were aware that uh, starting November 1st, which was like Friday, uh, we have a new special called Christmas Time is Here Sweet. So I wanted to share it. I have not had a chance to work with it yet. It arrived while I was away, and I wanted to show you what all is included. It comes in a gigantic sweet bundle, which you can get everything that I'm gonna show you here with one click of a button, or you can buy it piecemeal, which is great. I'm really, really happy about that. So it is called, again, Christmas Time is Here. And uh, it includes, so we've got a bundle with the Christmas Rose stamp set. It is a set of two, and it's got some great Christmas sayings, but I have been watching online and seeing other demonstrators are doing some amazing things with this that are not just Christmas. So I love when that happens because we can use it now into the holiday season, but you can continue using it because other things happen during the holidays. We have birthdays, anniversaries. Uh, thinking of you. Sometimes we need sympathy cards and this is such a gorgeous set. The great thing about this one is it is two-step and it comes with the main image is going to be your red cling rubber but then to make it a little bit easier for stamping the insides. Oh look there's already a pop dot wrapper in there. Huh those things come up everywhere. So it's got the photopolymer so that you can see through to um, line up your images. It's also great for coloring with the blends. So that's the Christmas or that's the Christmas rose stamp set. We have a coordinating set of dies here, which are absolutely stunning. So we've got some little images which are great. We've got these. Um, that work with your sentiments. And then of course this big one is what is actually going to cut out your rose. So it's designed to match that. The great thing about that is also with the coordinating DSP, and I am a sucker for DSP, you guys, this is gorgeous. So let me see if I can maybe do an every other. Okay, so we get four, four of the same. Okay, so we've got this one with the roses, and I don't know if the gold is showing, but these roses are outlined in gold, which is awesome. Then we've got this on the other side, which is always great when you have a busy pattern. The other side, we kind of slow it down and give it like a nice background image. Then we've got these four pieces here. And again, we've got the gold shimmer and this on the other side. And then we have the glorious rose. So you can see that this piece right here is actually going to work with your die cut. So if you don't want to go to the labor of love, let's see, they are right there. Look at that, perfection. You can, uh, you don't have to hand cut it out. You can actually use the die. This one, does that work with it? I'm kind of thinking no, but wouldn't that be cool if it did? It does not. I thought, well, if they kind of lined it up right. Nope. So it's just this big one in the middle. And then this is your other side with the pine cones and the little holly berries. So that's your designer series paper. Um, does that have a name? Hmm. I don't know. It's the Christmas Rose stamp set, the Rose Die. It is called Christmas Time is Here Designer Series Paper. And then we've also got the gorgeous gold metallic -y ribbon and gold metallic -y, like a, uh, the enamel dots with the glitter in them in four different sizes, so that's fun. And then of course, this is something new and different that we came out with this cute little box. And we've got a Stampin' Up! bracelet, kind of similar to uh, ones you'll see, popular ones that you'll see um, on the internet. I have a couple of them, but we've got the rose that coordinates and then we've got a little Stampin' Up! logo in gold as well. Now, this is, like I said, this is an entire suite. You can get all of these items. So all of these things together, one click of a button. And that is um, $112.50 for this entire suite. Now you can piecemeal it together as well. So if you just want the stamp set and the, um, 
the Christmas rose stamp set and the dies, you could get those bundled together and save yourself 10%. You can buy these individually. I believe you can buy the bracelet individually as well. Yes, you can. So all of these items are available individually or you can get the entire suite. So that is what's happening. It started in November. This is going to run until supplies last. So we may have it for a little while. We may have it for a week. We just do not know. So anyway, I haven't worked with it yet. I'm going to come back and I'm going to do, show you some projects that I made after my um, play session in the studio. So hey, hang Stampin' tight. Friends, I am back. Um, so I did my video this morning and I spent the whole day in my studio creating with my extra hour that I got today. So I'm videoing in the dark are in the night, um, which I don't normally do. So you're going to probably see a lot of shadow, but I did want to share what I created with the suite that I showed you, um, in my earlier video. So I started off and, um, there's a, there's a couple things I did. I just stamped a lot of these roses in black. This one I colored with the Stampin' Blends because I absolutely love our Stampin' Blends. And then I used um, Poppy Parade, Soft Sea Foam, and uh, I think that's, oh, and um, maybe Soft Suede for that. Put a little bit of gold accent in there and the gold enamel dots. So I'm just gonna kind of go through these real quick. Let me show you that one later because I need to open it up. Uh, here's a great one I did a little bit of gold embossing with, and then I cut out some from the Designer Series paper. That one's done in Cherry Cobbler. This is fabulous. Very little stamping, just the sentiment here. And then I used those, um, I don't know what they're called anymore, but this cuts and embosses to make that gorgeous frame with that designer series paper. Went pretty simple on this one, just a little bit of DSP. And this one I pulled in, this is actually the designer paper and I die cut it out. So it's already colored and ready to go. And then I used our Delicatata gold um, gold ink. Now I want to say um, that if you are interested in the metallic inks we have in the holiday catalog, get them while supplies last. Okay, I know that we are having a hard time keeping them in stock because they're super, super popular. And these are my favorite metallic inks I have ever used. And I've used a lot, you guys. Um, stamping up for 18 years, probably stamping total of 20 years. And this is amazing. So it has such a nice crisp image and still metallic -y. So absolutely love it. Put that on your wish list and get it while you can. Um, this is a fun easel card that I did. Again, I used the designer series paper, quick and easy, just, just cut it out and went with it. Um, it kind of pulls out like this, which you could put a sentiment in there if you want, but I went ahead and made it into a full card. And down here, the paper that these roses come out of kind of has these guys on the edge and they're cut off a little bit. So I really wasn't sure what you could do with them. I didn't want to waste. So I hand cut that and just glued that down in the corner and gorgeous. And you are not wasting much paper at all uh, when you go to die cut that out. So now this one um, is, again, designer series paper, but you would be able to use your stamps and go ahead and stamp everything in, which, yeah, that is what I did um, <clears throat> because it is fabulous. Now this one is a fun fold card, and you may be seeing this again at a class, but it has a little pocket in the side that you can put a gift card in. So fantastic little idea. Now I will preface and say all of these are cased. I did not create any of these on my own. This is a Pinterest. Uh, I dove in there today. I dove in head first, full on into Pinterest, and just started creating with what's already on there. So this one is fun. I'm going to share it with you now. It's a cute little box. This is fantastic. If you guys, I, I am pretty sure we're going to make this at my Wow Wednesday class coming up in November. But if, oh, it got bent. If you guys need little favors, um, you know, this is the time of year that you're, you're doing these little favor type things. Maybe you need them for teachers, bus drivers, scout leaders, you know, anyone, your favorite Stampin' Up! demonstrator. I mean, you need little favory type things, and this is fantastic. Now, it's empty, so imagine that I have this full of Hershey Nuggets wrapped with these little um, designer seri series paper. I have not been to the store to get nuggets, but this would hold 10 
Hershey Nuggets. Wrap them up real cute when you open it. Then also it's got this little flip top that you have a little um, gift card you can put in there as well or some cash, something like that. So a fun little treat or favor is perfect. Now I did want to share these last three. These are special, so pay attention you guys. During the month of November, if you purchase the sweet or if you purchase the bundle, so the suite is everything all together, the bundle is the stamp and the dies together, I am giving you a tutorial, so I'm giving this away. These three cards, you're gonna get everything you need to make these cards, so it's gonna be cut and ready to go. All you need to do is pull out your stamps and stamp them and you're good to go. So I've, I'm gonna give you a tutorial as well with the dimensions so that you can create more of them if you would like. Now, I did not do, I focused on Christmas, um, but this so easily would transfer to Valentine's Day because this paper and this rose, perfect for that. And just change out your sentiments. You could totally do thinking of you, happy birthday, happy anniversary, whatever you've got laying around. These cards, or this, this suite actually works well for everything uh, besides Christmas. So think about that. I always like to think when I'm when I'm purchasing something, what else can I use this for? So it's not just a holiday, definitely not uh, just a Christmas stamp set. So again, back on my, my train here, these three cards, you're going to get the tutorials and the supplies to create them for absolutely free when you purchase the Christmas time is here suite or the Christmas, uh, the Christmas Rose Bundle, which is the stamp and the dies, okay? So you're gonna have everything else that you need already cut, ready to go. So we've got this great stamp right, or this great, <laughs> I'm losing my train of thought. This great card right here, this is all stamped, you guys. This is a multiple step stamp, but oh, does it ever go together so well. I had no issues with it. So that's done in Cherry Cobbler, Poppy Parade, Mellow Moss, and uh, down here I did Soft Suede for the um, pine cones. So you get this card. You'll get this one also, which is done in Poppy Parade, and then I've got some soft sea foam here with these gorgeous gold lattice there. And then this fun fold card here. Again, all stamping, okay? So easy and great. Now, you could definitely purchase the designer series paper and just cut that out with the die, slap it on there, and that makes things go a little bit faster. So again, a tutorial for the month of November. When you purchase the Christmas Time is Here Suite or the Christmas Rose Bundle, you're going to get the everything to make these three cards plus a tutorial with dimensions and instructions free from me because I love ya. Now, um, this is valid, like I said, only through November. So what I'm gonna do is at the end of November, once I have all the orders in, uh, the first week of December, you're gonna get your to-go kit. So I hope that makes sense to you guys. Any questions, let me know. Thanks so much for joining me. I hope you have a wonderful week and I will see you next week for Movie Monday.